Suppose you're looking for a job and like most people in that position, all of a sudden you're hit with a ton of data, a ton of information. Go left, go right. This company, that company. This county, that county. Today, because of the internet and various directories, we can be deluged by information. And even if we had some semblance of where we wanted to turn, in other words, where we wanted to focus, there's so much competing for our attention. There's so many possibilities that we have trouble narrowing down the field and actually focusing. So I say one of the first things you do is this. If you live in a metro area of any size, say 50,000, 100,000 or more, draw a line maybe a mile, maybe five miles around your current location. So in other words, you end up with a circle and you have a radius of five miles. Now, within that five mile radius, are there enough companies? Are there enough potential opportunities for you? And in most cases, the answer is yes. If you have skills that are transferable between one organization and another, very often, the opportunities for you are right within drive time. So that's a quick and easy way to narrow down the field. Something else is to recognize that everybody has affinity for certain types of positions and certain types of industries. Regardless of where you went to school, regardless of what your work experience even happens to be, for what industries and what kind of work do you have a natural affinity? You can find out what your affinities are by taking any one of a number of career tests that are on the internet that career service counselors have available for you. But very often you can just ask people, hey, what am I good at? What do I enjoy doing? Very often you can get this list from yourself. Look around your den or your office. Look around where you work. What are you really good at? Is it organizing? Is it staying in touch with others? Is it follow-up? Is it feedback? Is it devising systems? Is it making lists? Is it crafting plans? The work that you enjoy doing and comes so easily to you is what you have an affinity for. And so to reduce stress in the job search, go with your strengths and you really can't lose.